Good evening Gary, thank you for joining us after this 1-1 draw, pre-season friendly, our way to Walsall Wood. Uh, conditions, fair to say, not great tonight, definitely not conducive to playing good football, but what are the positives that you can take from tonight's game? Yeah, um, obviously, you know, we knew coming to uh, a lower league team like Walsall Wood would be a good test for us, especially as the conditions, as you've already mentioned, we knew wouldn't be the best, not what we're accustomed to. Um, but sometimes you're going to come up against these kind of opposition, uh, maybe cup games or something like that. So you've got to try and adapt to the conditions and I thought we did that you know in the first half pretty well we made uh, several changes in the second half took a bit of the momentum out of the game but um, you know I basically tonight you know had another chance to view some more players again um, and uh, it's given me a lot of food for thought going forward to be honest. Would you have expected to see a little bit more of a difference in the quality given that there's two leagues between the two sides? Um, Definitely at times I thought the first 15 minutes I thought Warsaw Wood came out and they were very, very good um, in their shape and they, they stuck to their plan and they gave us a little bit of a tactical battle. Um, but then, you know, once we'd uh, adapted to the way they were playing and we changed our shape, we then took control of the game and I thought, you know, we could have gone in maybe a couple of goals uh, up um, at half time. But uh, take nothing away from them. They've, they've come out tonight and they've put their, uh, their all into the game and I knew it would be a good game for us, a good test for us. Um, and as you said, the conditions, especially the pitch and stuff like that, sometimes when you you come to these kind of places, that it can be a level A, you know, it brings you down to the level uh, of the opposition as well. So, but like I said, take nothing away from them. Uh, fair play to them tonight. They've come out and they've they've shown that they're capable of playing and they'll do well in their own league. Um, it was a good test for us as well. Four games into pre-season now, Gary, of course, uh, bumping along quite nicely. Uh, two wins, a draw and a defeat. Mm -hmm. what, what do you think that you've, you feel that you've learned really from the squad so far? Um, if I'm openly honest, I've learned um, the players that I believe I want to keep um, and the ones that I probably have to have a conversation with and that's what I'll take out of those four games going you know, after tonight. Well, absolutely. That's absolutely the reason that we have pre-season, isn't yeah. it? So you've learned a lot already. Yeah, definitely. You know, me, Tom and Andy have uh, been speaking regularly um, and we decided, you know, we'd go into another game tonight with uh, some trialists. Uh, and again, some of our younger academy lads have turned out tonight and we'd try and make sure as many of the, you know, the uh, regular first team players would get some minutes tonight. And we've done that and we gave people an opportunity to stake a claim and show what they're capable of. Uh, um, and it's taken us up until this fourth game where we, I think we're now ready to go ahead and make the decisions that we need to make, Kev. Looking uh, ahead now to Saturday's trip away to Romulus, are, there, are we likely to see a different starting eleven or any other fresh faces for Saturday? Um, uh, we're going to have some conversations, as I said, after tonight. Um, and I do believe you'll probably see uh, a smaller squad uh, going into Saturday's game um, with a few familiar faces that we all know. Um, and there'll be probably one, maybe two that I might have a look at again in that one game. But we'll, we'll definitely time to whittle the, the squad down and narrow it down to the, what we think is going to give us what we want for the season. Gary, as always, thank you very much for your time this evening. Cheers, you're welcome. 